I was supposed to fight John Lineker at UFC Fight Night Uberlandia, Brazil, but I got sick on weigh-in day and had to be taken to the hospital. I discovered through the site that he had told me that he had been sick. I was kind of surprised at the time, but then I got to know the facts and saw that he was really bad. I tried to tough through it, it just my body failed me. Me and Derek Brunson were scheduled to fight December 13th in Phoenix. Ate something I shouldn't have ate and got a little food poisoning and just decided it'd be best to postpone and reschedule the fight. All I know is I was warmed up, ready to go. We were on deck. Dana came in. I knew something was wrong, but I thought he was going to say like, yo, the winner of this fight gets a, gets a Harley or something cool. Instead, it was the opposite. You know, the fight's off. Having to fight at, you know, 50% is just not a good idea. A gente fica meio meio chateado, né? Porque a gente fez uma preparação muito intensa, muito dura, né? Para para essa luta aí chegar no dia não aconteceu, mexe um pouco com a cabeça da gente, mas aconteceu e, e com certeza esse tempo aí deu que que eu vim a treinar a mais. Having to train for someone for six months or whatever it is is not fun. You learn to like really dislike this person for no real reason, just besides the fact that you're fighting. I didn't see Derek until the next morning when I saw him strutting through the lobby, smiling and whistling like nothing was wrong. He came out there saying, hey, you don't look sick to me, you don't look sick to me. I was like, hey, we're going to fight regardless, you know, so you, what you're saying right now is just wasting time and just pretty much being a loud mouth. There was a little bit of trash talk on Twitter back and forth. It's been kind of fun because I've got to talk a little bit of smack, which I usually don't do. He was doing a lot of talking, I was doing a lot of talking, but, you know, that's the good thing about the UFC, that you get paid to duke it out, and that's exactly what we're going to do. This fight with me and John, it's pretty easy to break down. John's going to come in with big punches, he's going to try and knock my head off, and then I'm going to make him swing big and miss big, and then I'm going to finish him via submission. I think, analyzing the fight today, it would be a show for the public, of course, because everyone was waiting for that fight, and it didn't happen, so, of course, it will be a great spectacle. I'm going to try to find a victory all the time. I was trying to fight Derek in Boston. I was trying to fight Derek in Sweden. Now we're fighting this weekend at UFC 183, which is awesome because this is a huge card. I see Ed coming forward, you know, being really tough, being physical. I can see him running into a big shot. I can see me taking him down and submitting him. I just see my hand getting raised. I'm finishing Derek Brunson. I'm either going to knock him out or submit him.